Let's move on to number 55 here. What if principles? Shigaraki just had to go and drag in another guy with no principles whatsoever. Isn't there somebody in this league who cares? The series, uh, it has been uh, postponed um, in terms of like production due to the main actor being like injured during the during uh, filming. But they're already in talks of doing a season two um, of the of this live action series. Um, they um, also going to be around an hour or up to an hour long, which means they can pull off a full like story similar to how the anime each episode was its own story. Um, and then also um, in other live action anime news, uh, the anime or manga One Punch Man is getting a Hollywood live action film. Um, it's very very early on, but it has a it's got a speculated a couple of writers attached to it already. Um, you're asking, does anyone know a, a good anime? You're watching Fairytale, but you need a uh, a quick break. Um, I've not seen Helsing, but I would recommend um, Cowboy Bebop. Uh, it's 24 episodes, I believe, but each episode is like a standalone episode, like they go on an adventure. Um, I, I would, I, oh, I'm playing as Muscle. I thought I was playing as Davy here. Oh, that makes much more sense. Um, but I would recommend. Um, uh, I would I recommend Cowboy Bebop. I'd also recommend Para Parasite the Maxim, but that's another like 20 plus episodes. Um, I'm trying to think of like one that's shorter. There's, I think it's, um, it's not a slice of life as such, but it's my um, addiction to, what is it called? No, I'm trying to think what it's called. Um, we'll scrap that one because I can't remember what it's called. Um, Death Parade. Death Parade, I think, is 13 episodes. Death Parade's really good. Um, it's getting a season 2, but no guns life. You've seen Parasite, Jonas? That's great. I, I really like Parasite. I got the collector's edition over here in, um, um, in the UK. A really nice two pack collector's edition and the second pack comes with like volume one of the manga so really cool uh, virtual knights recommending dororo um it's available for streaming on amazon prime um, Dark Lies, uh, you recommend Helsing, it's about Alucard, a super strong vampire working for a family specialised in fighting vampires and the undead. Helsing sounds good, I know Helsing's like an old classic, um, but I've never, I've never touched it, I've never, uh, never watched it. And your age, you've also watched, uh, Dororo, and you've watched Death Parade, and you've watched Cowboy Bebop, wow. Um... I think the one I'm thinking of is my life as an MMO addict. I think it's something along those lines. It's on 12, 13 episodes. It's really good. I I'd, I'd recommend that. Um, it's um it's like um there's, there's a, it's a romance anime, but um it's pretty fun. Um, so we've unlocked heroic power headband and also just basic power headband, and then we've got heartless criminal title. So we now move on to number 56. What if bloodbath? Who doesn't love a good blood splatter? I know I do. The new guy gets it. He's always talking about spilling blood and guts. I bet he and I are gonna get along just fine. Helsing, uh, Dark Lives. Helsing's the only anime you own all episodes on DVD. That's cool, that's cool. Um, I actually have a, a very large um, anime collection and the majority I've not even watched yet. Um, I 
I've read High School of the Dead. Uh, High School of the Dead has some, like, I don't mind High School of the Dead, like, I think it's a pretty good manga. It is like full fan service and like, adult content, but like, I still think there's a bit of story in there. Prison School? Prison School is only 13 episodes. Right, so we need to like stab him so we can get his blood, but I don't think this character is going to be able to like transform into him. If the plus ultra move is um, Himiko Otoga transforming into the enemy they're facing, that would be really cool, I'd be really impressed there. So let's see if we can pull that off. Okay, we just wasted it straight off the bat. Oh, that's a pretty cool move, just constant slashing. No, I like High School of the Dead as well. I've yet to see the anime, but um, I, do, uh, uh, I do. I do. I did enjoy it. It's a shame. It like. So I think one of the the artists on the writer passed away, so the series like got an extra chapter by the brother or something, but the series hasn't gone on past. So uh, it's like ongoing, but it's like on indefinite hiatus. So I am on my anime list, so I'm just gonna see if I can uh, find some, like, you know, some shorter, uh, shorter animes to recommend. Recovery of a uh, recovery of, of an MMO jun junkie. That's the one I recommend. That's the one I. Um, that's the one I was thinking of. Yes, Yodes. I would watch that. Um, it's only short if you know you're interested. Um, so we unlocked a uh, monotone uh, Chaco's wrists, and then just simply Chaco's wrists there, and then we've got lead applicant title. So we now move on to what if punching bag. Number 57. Hmm, I don't think I recognize that guy. The hell's his deal? He won't say a damn word. It's funny you say that about um, Detective Conan, uh, case closed. It's only 974 episodes long, still ongoing. Um, it's actually got an English dub that's recently come out. Um, the English dub is um, the the English dub is only like a couple of episodes in, but an English dub is available. A virtual night you say my Twitch page says I'm streaming One Piece Power Warriors Four. That's strange because everything I've got it set up on on here would suggest that I'm playing My Heroes uh, One's Justice.
So we're Muscular versus Nanomu. It's strange that like like Nomu, if Nomu's a playable character, it's kind of like you're versing like Cell Junior. Um where it's like a where you are you playing a Cell Junior, or like it's not really a character, it's more of like fodder that just shows up. It's like if they had a One Piece fighting game, which they do, but if, if like Burning Blood had you could play as a, just a standard marine, it just it's just not a character. Oh, it's showing One Piece Pirate Warriors 4. I'll go into the video screen on the page. Yeah, I need to edit that and change that to My Hero Academia. Uh, that I completely forgot about that. That did uh, that didn't cross my mind there. Um, no more playable in My Hero 2. Ah, maybe not playable in one then. Um, you know, um, I'd also recommend uh, Kakigori. Um, if you're interested in that, uh, Compulsive Gambler. Um, it has a second season, but both episodes are only 12 episodes long and they're available on Netflix. Also has a live action movie and a live action TV series that are also really good as well. Um, trying to see what else I can recommend that's short. You've also watched Gambler? Uh, Sekiri, 1 and 2, Season 1 and 2 and Freezing Season 1 and 2 are also pretty good, but slight fan service for both. So unlock the monotone DJ headphones and also just send the DJ headphones. So we're now on 69% of the story with 42S rank. So now we move on to the Vanguard Action Squad. It's time to bring those vain empty heroes back down to earth. Let's light a fire for a bright new future and get to work. I really like uh, Kakuri Compulsive Gambler. Um, I'd recommend it to anyone. Uh, uh, it kind of, very early on, it kind of had similar vibes to Yu Gi Oh! Uh, but it goes past that, but um, I do, uh, I, I did enjoy, enjoy it very much. われ<笑> Um, so, again, another update. Uh, the Fairtail RPG, um, starting tomorrow in Europe, there is a uh, pre order available. Um, a, guild, a guild box. So. Uh, if you give me a moment, I can get the details. So yes, uh, the guild box is available on the PlayStation 4, Xbox One, um, and also Steam. The guild box will be £99, um, UK sterling, British pounds. Um, it will come with an original illustration that is uh, drawn by uh, Hiroshi uh, Hiro Mishi uh, Mishima. Um, it's a B2 size poster, so it's, it's fairly small. Um, also comes with a Sorcerer Magazine, a special issue, game release edition. So I think there might be like a little booklet. Um, I'm hoping it's actually physical and it's, it's got some content in there. 
Um, three designs of uh, 3D character cards, the ones that you kind of like till a bit and they move. Um, so there's one for uh, Urza, Natsu and Grey. Also comes with a special sticker set, that they, they call it special sticker set. Uh, but that has Natsu, Lucy, Grey, Urza and uh, Wendy on there. It also has um, Happy, Carla and... Um, Oh, the, the black cat, um, Gadgil's cat. I've forgotten his name. But it also comes with a PlayStation, oh no, it's not Xbox, sorry. It's PlayStation 4, Switch or Steam. The collector edition is what's the, called the Guild Box, uh, Yones. So the Guild Box, it's coming, it's all like paper content, really there's nothing physical, no models. But it comes with a B2 size poster, um, a magazine booklet, um, 3, uh, 3D character cards, they like got a bit of motion in them, and then a sticker set. So it is a collector edition, but they call it like the Guild Box edition. So we've unlocked the Compress Hat, or Striped Compress Hat. And we move on to number 59, Muscular Descent. Hell yeah, about time we get started now. I can let loose with my quirk. I'm so excited to go wreck some stuff. Ain't nobody gonna stop me. Thanks for watching. This is very much appreciated. If you like or dislike this video, then please hit the thumbs below and let me know what you think of the video length. If you're interested in more anime content, then I stream on Twitch in the evening, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. If you want to discuss this series and more, then join our Discord community. And if you want to keep up to date with anything that I'm doing personally in my free time, then feel free to follow me on Twitter. Thanks again. Bye for now.